I am honored to become your new president. Thank you for believing in me. This is sensational. A child became president of the country. My first day as president. Everything must be perfect. Miss President, welcome to your office. You are going to do great things. But first, you'll need to change into something a little more formal. You want my opinion? This is the president's yeah. suit. You know what? Mm. You could use a makeover uh -huh. too. Oh no! Mm. Kikarumi, oh you can't God. be serious. I refuse to wear it. All right, I'll take it all back. Thank you, Miss Abby. And please don't do that again. Turns out being yeah. head of state is more fun than it looks. Economic forums are an important part of the presidential routine. Nice Hi. to meet you, Miss President. I have so much information for you. Please begin. I'm all ears. Those charts are so boring. What's he talking about? Looks like Abby's getting distracted. Go on, sir. As I said, the situation is critical. Oh, that was to be expected. I think Miss President is already fast asleep. How is that possible? You just put her to sleep with your speeches. We'll need to take action now. We'll leave you to it. I can't believe it! You'll be much more comfortable here! Okay! Sweet dreams, Miss President! I wonder how long I've been sleeping! Let's see what's going on in the world! And we have breaking news! Miss President oh. fell asleep in the middle of an economic forum! Right in front of an amazed audience! So, oh. I didn't dream those charts? What a beautiful day for oh. a walk! Look! Is that a stray dog? What an injustice! It's about time I made my first law! All homeless animals must be given a home! From now on uh -huh. and forever! Come here, little doggy! Where are you going? Good afternoon, Hi. miss! I have a present for you! Wow. I can't believe it! A gift from the president herself? There you go! Bye -bye. Now the doggy's oh in God. good hands! I'm going to name you little Bobo! Doing good deeds feels great! Look, they need my help too! It looks like the poor man has lost his home! He must be very hungry and cold! We must solve this problem right away! All people must have a place to stay! Get out of the way! I have an important new decree! No more homelessness! From this moment on! Leave me alone! I didn't do anything! Yes, Mr. Teddy! I will bring order to this country! Miss President, I got him! What's next? Oh, Brandon! What are you doing? You should have just given him the money! Here you go! A down payment on a new house! Oh. Being president is so much fun! You can sing your favorite songs and twirl around in your chair! It's a shame these grown-ups are so serious. They could use a little relaxation. Look what I drew. Oh. They don't seem to care about my art. Uh-oh, is Miss Abby crying? That's not good. We need to save the situation immediately. We are so sorry. We didn't mean to upset you. Why don't we all draw together? And we'll hang your masterpieces in a very prominent Yay. place. There you go. See? We thought everything through! All the president's wishes are law! Abby always hey. wanted to go to space! Welcome to NASA, Miss President! Please make yourself at home! Uh -huh. Alright! How about sending me to the moon? Just imagine! The first president in space! Hmm. Legendary! Let's see! Close your eyes! First, Let's get some special training! If you want to become a real astronaut, you can't do without a test of strength! Look at that! Wow. It's a dream coming true! What an unbelievable sight! You only need a VR headset to go to space! Whoa! I wow. had no idea that the stars could be so close! I finally have a free minute! 
I can play a game. Let's have a tea party. All right. How about a cup of tea for you, Miss Squirrel? This is a spoon for you, and this is for you, Abby. All these games are making me hungry. But I'm the president. Hey. That means I can eat whenever I want. Miss Abby, your lunch is ready. Oh, Enjoy yeah. it. Huh? This food is too healthy. It's all vegetables. No way. No. I'm not eating that. Is that how they want to feed the head of state? Well, they asked for it. No more vegetables. That's an order. Do it now. This is what you get for upsetting the president. Here's a new decree. People should give up vegetables. Hey, oh, sir, you aren't you interested oh. in forbidden foods? Broccoli is now oh. illegal, as are tomatoes yeah. and eggplants. Certainly, sir. I hope that's enough. I'll take all there is. What yes. a good deal. Yes. Thanks, man. Uh -huh. Time to run home and water our forbidden vegetable garden. <laughs> Presidents go to the movies, too. Hey, that couple in the front row. They are being rude. Hold my popcorn, Miss President. You look like you're having a lot of fun, don't you? What? And I don't want to see you here again. That's better. Finally, we can enjoy the movie. It's our first date. And to be honest, I'm a little nervous. You are the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Oh, what terrible acting. Hey, do you think we could get that guy out of the shop? Uh -huh. I'll do my best. Okay. I hope I didn't spoil your appetite. Mr. Actor, leave the stage immediately. Hi. And now, a real professional takes over. Mm. You're as beautiful as our star. Oh no, like a starry sky. How romantic. <laughs> Bravo, I am so <gasps> proud of you. When the president is sick, the whole country is sad. Oh. What's wrong, Miss Abby? I don't feel well. We'll fix you, I promise. Uh -huh. Have a seat. We're going to take a look at you. Oh, it's all clear. Uh -huh. We need to uh -huh. give you a little shot. Mm. Did you say a shot? Uh-oh, I don't like those. Stop. Wait a minute, important presidential business. I need to issue a new executive order right away. I'm canceling all shots. This can't be happening. Candy instead of medicine? As you wish, miss. Done. Excuse me, doctor. That's the law. Jelly beans and candy. That's what cures colds from now on. Of course, Miss President. As you please. And it's really helping. I feel so much better. Thanks for your help, doc. We gotta go. Phew. What a day. A little sugar wouldn't hurt either. Presidents have to study too, especially if they are kids. And now Abby will come to the blackboard. I don't feel like it. Tell us about the composition of the human body. The human body consists of, uh, not one clever thought. Oh. All right, young lady, you may take your seat. It's an F minus. Why do I always get called to the board at the worst possible moment? Hey, what if Miss President has a new executive order? It's time to reconsider the way things are. What's on your mind? Just one little prank. I can't wait to see it. From now on, all the teachers will sit at the students' desks. Have a seat, ma'am. You are about to take a test. Miss Jackson can't believe this is happening. I'm going to be grading you. Believe me, I am a very strict teacher. What nerve. Are you doubting my abilities? Hmm. Let's see, Mr. Rodriguez. Get your grade. An F? This is too much. And you, Miss Jackson, you don't know anything either. But how come? All the answers were correct. It's time to elect a new president. Will Abby be able to hold on to her position? Introducing the second candidate. Look how well he's holding up on the stage. And little Bobo yeah. becomes president. Congratulations! This is so unfair. Is a dog better than me? Excuse me, miss, but I'm no longer your guard. Mr. President! 
confident! We are going to do great things! Did you like this story? Do you think little Bobo would make a good president? Let us know in the comments! Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button so you don't miss new silly and exciting videos from Troom Troom Select!